<laughs> don't chase me, don't chase me! <laughs> These are damn naughty here. <laughs> Good morning guys, so today is our official first day in Chuangzhou. It is about 9 plus, but you can still see that it's just becoming bright. So I guess days are pretty short here in Chuangzhou. But yeah, we're gonna take you around our reindeer visit as well as the Northern Lights and we'll hopefully can catch the Northern Lights. So see you in a bit. We are now at the area where all the reindeers are and we are just gonna go feed the reindeers now I think Svern is somewhere there Svern, I'm gonna find you Svern So, are you ready? So we went to a reindeer farm and they gave us buckets of food to feed the reindeer. It was really a calming experience feeding the reindeers and being in the snow. Into the camera. Alright, thank you. Hello. Hey buddy. Hey hey. <laughs> Definitely had a lot of fun feeding them, but oh, my roommates, well, not, yeah. maybe not so much. Okay, okay, enough, enough, no more already, no more, hey. Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey, don't hit me, you hit me, I'll slap you, eh. <laughs> you get, no more, eh. You see, see, that one there, that one there. This, that is, one, that one. this is how Sam's gonna be as a parent. That one, that one, that one. Yeah. That one there, no more already, hey. You see the other Sam, the other Sam, there, there. We then headed inside the warm inn for something a little bit sad. So we are eating reindeer meat right now. Sam thoughts. Very nice. So you can just see the snow outside right now. After that we were treated to a number of Nordic stories about the reindeer shepherds. And who else makes this than grandmothers? The days felt really short in Tromsø and soon we were heading to our next activity, the Northern Lights Chasing. Okay, go ahead. Hello. Hi. Good lights through because the Northern Lights is happening so high up. Men's wearing green for the Northern Lights, manifesting. We're gonna set up a mini campfire over here. 
uh, fished along the Norwegian coast, especially in winter now. It's what they create the turfisk, the, the, the dried fish. It's a bit more of a bulky, more of the earth, and, and that creates the magnetic field. And the magnetic is about negative 10 degrees, so it's pretty cool. But hopefully, you see these northern lights in 3, 2, 1. Good morning everyone. So today is officially our day two in Tromsø, Norway. We just did the Northern Lights chase last night, so pretty tired. We are starting our day quite late today. So yeah, we are supposed to go to see the ice domes today, but it got cancelled because of a snowstorm last week. So today we're just gonna chill, try and find things to do in Tromsø, and maybe see the Northern Lights again today. But yeah, we will go and get some lunch because we're all starving. And yeah, see you in a bit. So today is the end of our day two and we are, turns out we're going to see another round of Northern Lights. So in case you're wondering which tour operator we went to, we took the Chasing Lights tour operator and shout out to our friend Nikki for helping us set up the second night as well. So yeah, hopefully we'll see better Northern Lights and see you there. You took, I think, the most important part. <laughs> hey guys, so we're here on our second chase for the Northern Lights. So, we're out here at this open field right now. There are like two big buses of people just you know, waiting for the Northern Lights right now. So, we're in a very open area. Hopefully, there's some Northern Light activity soon. And this is what greeted us moments later. Thanks again. Bye. Have a good one. Let's go. Well. Once I've seen it, oh, no, just this side. Wow. It's built in the beginning of the Second World War by Germans. And uh, the Third Reich uh, built eBay. Our last day in Tromsø led us to a road trip around the Fjord Mountains. Oh, 
house is blocking the road. Favorite house over there with the windmills on the top. Uh, just the water scratching as well. Smong's over there. And Santa is back in the bus because man, it's freezing. But yeah, it's pretty cold here. I think my feet are freezing already, but this is really our last day in Chomzo. And we're just going to enjoy the scenery a bit more. Today is also the first time in about two months since the sun appeared in Norway from so. So you can see the orange because the sun is actually setting right now. Let's get going. Hey guys, so it's been a very good trip to Tromso. One of our bucket lists has been ticked, so we can't wait for more adventures during our exchange. But yeah, this is the end of the Tromso vlog, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers guys.